All right, this one's gonna be on Vim folding. I learned about this yesterday. It's actually pretty cool. I wish I'd known it earlier. But let me give you an example here. Let me use our dump file or my dump file here. Let's say you have long lines of code, and um, you only want to know like the first line of it, um, so you know what it does, and everything else in between you want to hide it. Uh, you can do that with uh, Vim folding. It's built-in feature, and um, you know you can you can actually apply this to like maybe taking notes if you want like today's date and then everything under it is your notes so same concept here but we want to fold this so how do we do this you can do this in visual mode and there's a few ways you can do this but I prefer the, the visual mode uh, usually so shift V right and then go down with the J and then when you got all you think that you want you push um, ZF and there you go it hides four of them right there if you want to delete it, let's say um, you messed up or something, ZD is to delete. Um, so that's how you do it in visual mode. If you want to do this in um, normal mode, you just go ZF and the number of how many lines you want to hide, and then J, right? So ZF, I think there's four here, and then J, and there you go, it hides the, the lines. Another way to do it, you delete this here, ZD. Uh, is to do like a searching kind of way so ZF slash and then you search for like the ending brackets here let's say I want to end it right here right at this bracket so let's do that ZF slash and we type in the ending bracket and then enter and there you go you'll just um, hide those three lines right there right the way that you will expand it and then collapse it is just ZA ZA right that's for one. I'll show you how to do all the uh, all of them at one time too. Let me see here. So let's do this for the rest of them. Let me do it with um, visual line here. Uh, ZF here we'll do visual line ZF. So let's say for example like all your codes are um, uh, I guess uh, collapsed. If you want to expand all of them at the same time instead of you know going to each one of them go ZA ZA like this. If you want to expand all of them, uh, just touch um, Z capital R and it'll expand all of them at one time. If you want to minimize them again, you can go Z capital M and there you go. You can see it um, however you like. But I like this way because um, you know when you're navigating you just want to see like the first line of it, what it does and you can skip it real quick. So you imagine if you have like a long line of code, you can actually um, you know go up and down your um, your code real quick using this right and it's built in feature the way that you will save the fold though it's uh, a lot of manual work so I, I don't really recommend the manual way uh, I recommend just putting this into your VimRC right but otherwise it will not save your fold when you you know write it out and exit so let's exit this here uh, colon x to write and save that but what you want to do is type this into your VimRC to save as you exit and load it up again. It's just this two lines. You want to add this into there. This one and then this one. And basically uh, it will tell it to save the fold and then load it again once uh, we open. That's basically it. There's also the hotkeys but that's just the gist of you know what you can do there. Anyways, go try it out if you're a Vim user. That'll be it for this one.